people, so in this video, this is going to be the first video of a new series I'm starting called Lift Insider. Now today is basically where a series where I will be taking a look at different aspects of lifts. So today we're going to be having a look at bagel system. Bagel system buttons are those metal buttons here. Wait, hold on, if I go outside, I don't want to. So vandal resistant buttons, as you can see, they are for this, this is a vandal resistant button that was Schindler lift. And as you can see, it is entirely metal. And the whole idea of it is that it's not meant to, um, it is resistant to people vandalising it. So the problem is with a lot of lift buttons, uh, with vandalism, that people tend to pop off the bezel of the button. And that could cause a result in the government and for best of that. So to resolve this issue, they made the buttons entirely metal, so, no, so it's harder for a vandal to, and to damage the button, which is then much more durable than a traditional. traditional plastic button. So now we're going to look at the other lifts in this building which do not which have non patent vandal resistant buttons and we'll have a look at the differences. Okay, so now we are in a non vandal resistant button lift. And as you can see they are very different. Again, these are shinders. As you see, they are very different to vandal resistance. Vandal resistant buttons are fully metal, and they have a metal so, disc sort of button. So, as you can see, these buttons are very different. 